Hey there, this is Darren. Uh, whew, it's uh, about one in the morning here in India, and I've been compelled to do this video because it's kind of ironic how things happen, but who do you need to ask for forgiveness from? To? Not sure. Let's go with from. But who do you need to ask forgiveness from? Um, I had a huge transition in my life after I was here in Chennai, India last time. Uh, There's a lot of circumstances, but there was just one, there's always that one moment that you remember that you carry with you. Uh, and maybe because it carries shame. And I think it was for me for sure. So back in 2013, um, I was starting to get a little um, egotistical. I remember I was starting to think I was better than other people. So when I won the world championship, like that was like life changing and brought me confidence I never ever had. But then after a few years and lots of pictures being taken and let's just say my ego got fed and once humility was like gone and like then it kept blowing up. Hey there, Jana Camp. And so there was a moment here, literally in this hotel, and that's what kind of reminded me of this, that I was in this hotel in India, literally six years ago. And I'm an introvert, so I get tired and Sometimes I kind of get overwhelmed with people talking to me and asking questions and taking pictures and and I know better I know that you know, I reach a point. Okay See I gotta go and I go up to my room and escape and for one reason or another I didn't last time I was in this hotel the Hilton in Chennai and there was a young man who stuttered and super nice gentleman and he asked me a question that I Wouldn't have known myself early on but I remember just being tired and cranky and be like, that's like stupid. That's such a stupid question. And I remember trying to put on the game face and trying to be nice, but, but I think I was kind of mean. And that was 2013 and a lot of other things took place. But I remembered that moment. I remembered that young man. And uh, when I was coming back here, it was a good thing. It actually led to me in 2014 getting baptized at Verve Church. And I definitely need a little humbling after that too. Because I might have an area that I've maybe excelled at, but I'm not better than anyone. And how dare I? Like, all the people want pictures taken with me. And it's like, okay, uh, how bad is that, Darren? Shut up. Stop your whining. <laughs> It was a day when you wish someone would want your picture taken with you. And so this is literally the hotel and the hallway. And I remember I was standing right over here, right in this hallway. And I just got mad and frustrated with him. And I kind of burst out. And it wasn't nice. It wasn't kind. It just was. And I remember going up to my room, but I brought with me a lot of shame. And I've been carrying it for six years. Um, it was in the back of my head. And I was hoping that today I would meet that same man right here. And I didn't. And I was kind of disappointed in that because I thought I lost my chance. But later on tonight... I ended up running into him and I apologized and he didn't even know. He didn't even remember. It didn't strike him and, and maybe I had enough of a game face on that I could in fact say I'm sorry. Or maybe to him, he didn't even notice that I was mean. And so it's kind of funny that he'd never thought twice of it. He came up to me smiling and eager to see me and it was... It was kind of cool, but at the same time, it's like, I need to, A, forgive myself, but I also need to forgive, ask him for forgiveness, which I did. And I was so thrilled to get that opportunity. So, is there something that you're carrying with you that you need to forgive somebody? 
they may or may not have noticed. Um, but it doesn't matter. If you're carrying it with you, you noticed. And this was, uh, well, thank you, Jeff. To era is human, but at the same time, at that point in my life, I was thinking I was better than this young man, and I wasn't. I might have an area of strength, and he had a question. It was, that, it was total ego. Why would I be upset at a question? Just because it seemed to be a silly question, he's a beginner. When I was a beginner, I had stupid questions myself. So there is no excuse, and I'm not gonna just blame it on I'm human. So thank you for that. Um, I will forgive myself now, but I was really thrilled to meet him and ask him for forgiveness. When I described the situation, didn't, didn't even remember, but I did. So if you forgive or ask for forgiveness from the person who hurt you, maybe it'll just lighten your load just a little bit. It did for me. See ya.